On May 31st, 2023, the world changed forever. We got the first footage of the most horrifying monster that we now know as the Skibbity Toilet. At first glance, the Skibbity Toilet appears like any ordinary porcelain toilet, deceiving its victims with a facade of normality. However, upon closer inspection, it reveals its twisted and ghastly nature. An unsettling presence that defies reason and comprehension, it preys upon the unsuspecting souls who dare to cross its path. In today's video, we'll get to know about the sad and tragic origin of the entity Skibbity Toilet. The story begins in a remote research facility where Dr. Michael Harrison and his team pursued a groundbreaking endeavor. The date was December 2019. Using cutting-edge genetic engineering and regenerative biotechnology, they sought to create a creature with the potential to consume all the plastic and bio-waste created by humans. Fueled by passion, they started conducting dangerous experiments that defied the laws of nature. As their ambition grew, they unknowingly created a force so horrifying that it would forever change the course of humanity. By mixing different animal protein, they were able to create a small, worm-like creature that started feeding on the plastic and waste given by the scientist. In their blind arrogance, they ignored the warnings of the few sane members of their team who knew the potential consequences of their actions. Amidst the excitement and caution, the scientists housed the now worm-sized, skibbity creature within a high-security glass container. For some time, all seemed well, as the creature thrived and demonstrated remarkable abilities. It was able to eat and digest 10 pounds of plastic. Within 30 minutes, the plastic was gone. It was a groundbreaking creation. The scientists thought they were going to change the world forever in a good way. But Skibbity had other plans in its mind. The worm-sized Skibbity was eating all kinds of plastic and bio-waste. It was developing a huge appetite. And it was housed inside a thick fiberglass container. Scientists were sure that the worm will not be able to escape the glass. But with its remarkable digestive capacity, it slowly started eating and digesting the glass. One night after the shift was over, all scientists went home. Lights were dim. A peculiar song was playing on the radio. Skibbity Dub Dub Dub. Skibbity saw the opportunity. It was not only growing in size and increasing its appetite, it was also developing a consciousness. Hence, it can think now. And Skibbity wanted to escape its cage, so it started chewing on the glass. Finally broke the glass and escaped. As the glass broke, a loud alarm got triggered. As panic ensued within the laboratory, Skibbity seized the opportunity to escape through the chaos. Slithering with alarming agility, it navigated through the laboratory infrastructure before finding an opening into the city's sewers. Inside the sewer, Skibbity developed fully functioning brain inspired by humans. It started to even look like a human with a human head and a long neck. The dark, damp environment provided a suitable refuge for the Skibbity's unforeseen metamorphosis. Without the laboratory's restrictions, it tapped into its full potential, rapidly growing in size and multiplying at an alarming rate. The once timid, worm-like entity transformed into an insidious menace, and its numbers growing exponentially within the gloomy underworld. Searching for food, Skibbity started to crawl out of the sewers into the real world. However, it didn't want to get caught, and the perfect place to merge into the real world were all the toilets inside human houses. A long connecting chains of pathway 
spreading all over the town. It got easier for Skibbity to go in and out of the sewers using these toilets. That's how it got the name Skibbity Toilet. Getting tired of all the waste, Skibbity started craving real food. Soon it started craving humans. Thus began the eradication of the human race. Everyone in the city got a toilet, and Skibbity can now eat all the food at once. Skibbity was emerging through the toilets at night when everyone was asleep. Without making any noise, was crawling to the bedrooms of the humans, finally consuming its favorite food, humans. Whenever Skibbity enters a house, a pungent odor of decay and decayed matter oozes from its depths, assaulting the senses and causing a nauseating sensation that lingers long after it's gone. Furthermore, these attacks left no survivors, but the security camera captured the real horror. Many people started saying they hear an eerie music at night. Skibbity dub dub dub. That's how they know something's coming for them. It's the sound of their demise. News of the Skibbity Toilet's existence eventually surfaced, igniting fear and paranoia among the city's inhabitants. The public demanded answers, and the authorities were clueless on how to address the ever-growing menace. Teams of experts were dispatched to investigate. As the city descended into chaos, rumors and urban legends about the Skibbity Toilet began to circulate, fueling nightmares and anxiety among the population. Finally, people took pictures and videos of Skibbity Toilet. Skibbity Toilet sightings started going viral on social media. Finally, we saw the monster in full glory. Skibbity Toilets can stretch their necks out several feet in the air. They can also bend and rotate their heads in any direction. Their facial expressions are characterized by highly exaggerated feature, with wide, manic eyes and an unnaturally wide, stretched-out grin. After their first appearance on May 31, 2023, it took only one year for the entire human civilization to end. The date was called the Great Skibbity Outbreak. Humanity was not prepared to fight these skibbities. It was not ready for such a threat, but in the last-ditch effort to save humanity, the whole world scientist community put their effort on creating few saviors. Yes, the cameraman, who is an entity with a closed-circuit television camera for a head with an average height of 5 foot 7, wears a white shirt with a black tie, a black suit with black pants, and a pair of black gloves. They have variants like normal cameraman, large cameraman, even ninja cameraman, and many more. Then comes speaker man, with the body of a human in a suit and the head of a speaker. Even speaker man has variations, and they even have their own titan in the form of titan speaker man. The TV men, mysterious yet terrifying to the skibbity toilets, they manifest in times of aid to help the cameramen and speakermen by attacking through emitting psychological beams of some kind from their screens. They've now become a member of the Alliance, assisting the cameramen and speakermen. They are our last hope, the last defense of humanity. But the fight is still not over. As we prepared our last defense against the Skibbity, they started mutating increasing in size and strength. Only time will tell who will survive in this ongoing fight for control.